Is there any other equipment to consider to help you with proper uh, coolant filtration? Hi everyone, Justin Geach here with Master Fluid Solutions. Uh, today I'm in Pensacola, Florida, visiting Adam Booth, also known as A-Bomb 79th. So we talked about the, uh, the sump shark and uh, you know coolant filtration machines. Is there any other equipment to consider to help you with proper uh, coolant filtration? Yeah, in, in coolant management in general, there's there's a lot of a lot of different equipment. So from your basics, every shop should have a, a refractometer. PH yeah. strips help. Um, we'll talk about mixers, and then you get into your coolant and fluid maintenance, which is your sump suckers. Um, and then you know we talked about tramp oil and getting the contaminates out of the fluid. So things like belt skimmers are, are inexpensive and can help you get some of that that tramp oil out. And when you look at tramp oil, your your starting point is a belt skimmer. Then if you have more more leaks and are more effective um, tramp oil removal, then you can get into a coalescer. And a coalescer basically sucks the fluid out into a separate tank, allows the oil to pop to the surface and then it skims it off. So a skimmer works really well if there's a um, stagnant layer of oil on the top, but when your coolant is circulating and flowing, it's mixing up and a skimmer won't pick that up. Right. Whereas a coalescer will. And the goal is to get tramp oil out of the coolant before it becomes emulsified. Yeah. Because once it becomes emulsified, it's part of the coolant and the only way to get it out is with your next step up, with it, which is a centrifuge. Okay. So. Depending on your needs, there's anything from belt skimmers all the way to centrifuges, recycling equipment to skimmers, refractometers, mixers. There's a whole range of, of fluid management equipment out there. And, and that's part of what we, what we would do is we would come in and evaluate your needs and help recommend that. And even in the 70s, you know, we started coolant recycling, so we have a lot of history with that. Yeah. And a lot of people think you, know, you put a recycling system on put bad coolant into a recycler, it magically comes out good, but that's not, that's not the case. So we help people walk through that whole recycling process. Okay. Um, and what's needed before they invest in that equipment. So um, we can help show you, you know, if you're using a, a shop vac to what, what it looks like and how quickly your machines can get clean with a sump sucker. Um, and we help, we help shops when their entire fluid management practices. Yeah. So there's, there's a very broad range. It can kind of be overwhelming. A lot of it is a significant investment, so we want to make sure you know, we have the right thing for, for a shop's needs. Absolutely.